Cass and just a big cat. Thank you. Today we're learning more about the young man who died on Western Boulevard in Raleigh last night. This is 23 year old Anthony Day. Police found him at the scene of a car crash and then discovered he'd been shot. WRL's Chelsea Donovan spoke to Day's family and friends. Chelsea, what did they say about him and what are you learning about the investigation at this point? Lena, Anthony Day was less than a minute from work up the street on Western Boulevard at the cookout when Raleigh police say that he was fatally shot. But what led up to that shooting, as well as a motive, is still unclear this afternoon. Cards, candles, and condolences sit below a tree on Western Boulevard, steps away from NC State, where friends say 23-year-old Anthony Day was shot and killed Monday night. It was like a shock to everybody because he was on his way to work. He gets here at 5.30. This was the scene from Sky 5 Monday night. You can see the cars piling up at Western and Varsity. In that wreck, Anthony Day's car, one unmistakable to those who knew him. As soon as I seen the car on the knees, it just really made me start crying, tearing up because Anthony loves his car. Raleigh police say Day was fatally shot and five cars were involved in the collision. However, they won't say what led up to that incident and the shooting. The road was blocked for hours as investigators scoured the scene. And I just hope and pray that they find out who did that because we trying to figure out was it road rage or something because he was so close to the job. His friends and co-workers said he had a passion for cars, anime, paintball and his family. The Heritage High School graduate had just lost his mother last year. I know his family is really going through a lot because it's just traumatic. Now, Raleigh police say this was an isolated incident with no threat to the public. No one has been arrested today for the crime. Lena. A lot of outstanding questions here. Chelsea Donovan reporting live for us in Raleigh. Thank you. We'll soon know who won.